up guys welcome back once again it is me Molt. so happy to be back with you guys from Austin um, yeah my trip was really good I had a lot of fun I got to see some old friends um, and play in an alumni baseball game etc um, alumni won yeah that's right we were the Knights so go us <laughs> but anyways um, it's a little early right now so that's why I'm talking quiet for you guys that's why I might look a little sleepy but since I haven't gotten a video out for you guys in a couple of days, that's why I'm doing it now. Um, but what we have today is another episode of Max That. And as you can see, I've been raiding really, really hard um, for Elixir. So, yeah, the biggest thing that we are going to be upgrading today, I read through all the comments, and most people said to do Barbarians. Um, some of you said Balloons, etc. I don't really use them. I think I use Barbarians the most. So um, I'm going to be upgrading those right now, and it's going to take 10 days. So, there we go. There goes all of that elixir. <laughs> so in 10 days we are going to have um, barbarians, which is going to be awesome. As you guys can also see in the top right, I have a lot of dark elixir. Um, I've been protecting it really well, trying to raid um, and keep it safe, not using any dark troops or anything like that. So um, I need you guys to tell me as well what you think I should upgrade. Should I upgrade my um, king, my queen? Or I guess, well I'm not going to be able to do any of that for uh, 10 days, I'm not going to be able to research any troops. Um, I guess eventually I could do hogs, but I really want to upgrade my heroes I think. So um, let me know which of my two heroes you guys think I should upgrade and uh, we will be doing that very very soon. Also as you can see, I have almost 3 million gold, um, so we're going to be upgrading this cannon very very shortly as well. I might do that off camera, um, but yeah, so why don't we go ahead and go and have a raid? <laughs> have a raid. Um, come on. <laughs> um, so I've been doing, obviously as you guys can see from my army camp, it's a little different. Yes. So this is the perfect kind of base that I look for now as I, um, as I lazy farm, if you will. So really we can just pick off these buildings right out here and then we'll be able to get in there and get the majority of that elixir. We also need to just take out the king. Um, where are so we can get all that gold for free right there we can almost get all that gold for free um, I'm just gonna go take it out with some barbarians um, we're not even gonna need to use all of our troops on this at all uh, let's take out this army camp right here and begin working our way into um, I'm sorry I'm tired <laughs> begin working our way into those gold mines so um, looking for bases like this is awesome as you can see we are about to get all of the yeah we just got all of the elixir none of it is even in the town hall um, so we can actually go ahead and um, start taking out the rest of these mines and we are going to have a lot of troops left over I didn't have to use my giants I didn't have to use um, anything like that no spells so that's awesome um, there we go we're probably not going to get in there to that dark elixir and I'm not really too worried about it so why don't we go ahead and surrender as you can see that is a great raid a great find um, you guys saw that it didn't take that long at all and why don't we go ahead and just go back on the attack and see if we can find anything else um, that is pretty close to um, the same amount so as you can see from this base what I think I'm going to do on this one um, I do still have enough troops I think to attack it so we're going to go ahead and drop down our giants um, and then let's see there's a giant bomb of course let's see if we can't get in here um, to this golden elixir storage so let's drop down a heal spell and a rage spell as well um, and then I'm going to drop down a whole bunch of barbarians and um, I'm going to drop down my king and I'm going to rage him and let's see if he'll go in good so he's going in right after the um, elixir storage and we can get our rest of our barbarians inside as well as our archers to take out um, that elixir storage as well we will not be able to take that out for free the town hall that is um, but we should be able to get some of these other uh, pumps as you can see right out here and it looks like most of I thought we were gonna get a lot more from those two storages but it ends up that we didn't um, however his dark elixir pump right here is completely full move arches good um, so I'm gonna see if we can get that with um, maybe our Archer Queen. Um, let's see if she can get in here. Yes, perfect. All right, so Archer Queen got in there. I'm just going to go ahead and make her invisible um, as she takes this out for free. 
and um, we are going to end right there so that I don't have to give up any more of her. So 95,000 gold, 102,000 elixir. Uh, for those two raids, guys, that's pretty good. That's over 200,000 um, of each resource for a very, very cheap, cheap army composition. Um, so that's the way that I've been raiding lately, um, and I think that it has been working fairly well for me. Um, as you can see, we I don't remember where we were at. We might have been at like 2,500 uh, or 2,500,000 gold, something like that. But yeah, so that's the army comp that I've been using lately. I always have eight giants, I think. Uh, this is the way that I'll do it. I always just fill my camps up, and then my tier one troops are always random. Um, my tier whoops are all <laughs> my tier whoops. My tier um, one troops are always just random. I'll just go through and do this with them. Um, and most of the time they always get trained up. I'm going to get rid of some of these. And yeah, that's been working really well for me. Um, no big issues with it. I like it a lot. It's super cheap. And that's the one way that over the weekend I was able to get like 5 million elixir. Uh, so yeah. But that is going to be it for this episode, guys. I hope that y'all enjoyed. Um, I'm happy to be back with you guys making videos. Um, and yeah, thanks for watching. You guys rock. We're growing a lot. We're almost to 32,000. And hey, as always, guys, make sure you keep calm and clash on for me, right? I'll see you guys later.